Hey guys, it's Danielle with Danielle Gets It Done, and today I'm gonna show you how I organize my changing table and all the cloth diapers. Gonna love you, honey, on and on and on. I'm a morning dove singing out a song. This video is sponsored by Stork Craft. Be sure to check them out below. They sent me the beautiful dresser that you'll see here from their new line. I'm obsessed. I really like using a dresser instead of a changing table because she can grow into it. So now it's her changing table. We change her on it and we keep all the diapers in the drawers. But as she grows, we will start to keep her clothes in it and we can keep it instead of just donating it and use it throughout her childhood. You can get these dressers on Amazon, at Target, at Walmart, they're all over. And it took my husband a couple hours to put together. He said it was pretty easy. I love the gray color that I purchased, but it comes in several colors and I just cannot be more happy. In the top left drawer, I have her newborn pre-folds, the snappies and the Grovia inserts. I use Grovia probably the most often, so I wanted to keep those in the very top drawer. On the right hand side, I have all of the diapers that are kind of ready to go, so they're either all-in-ones or pockets that are stuffed or diapers that have the insert snapped in, so these are just ready to go on the left. And then on the right, I have the covers both for the pre-folds and for the flip system. This middle drawer, I have the flips inserts and just other random inserts that I use with the different diapers I have. And then in this middle drawer, I have kind of the diapers that aren't fitting yet. So the pre-fold covers for the larger size and these diapers, they technically fit her, but they're not working so well right now so i just have these to try on later that's it for the diapers in the bottom drawers i just have some clothes that people gifted her that don't quite fit yet so i just want to kind of throw it in there and we'll take it out and launder it when she will fit in them and then kind of the same thing over here um this is just a towel that i actually just need to wash and then these are her sleep sacks for the snoo in different sizes. I wanted to show you this that came with the dresser. It says, keep it tidy, little one. This is Norma's very first chest. You were only, what, a week old when you started collecting stylish outfits. So it's just something to fill out. And then you're supposed to put a picture of your baby in their Sunday best and just kind of keep this as a keepsake. I think that is so special and cute. I try not to keep a ton on top, but I do obviously have her changing pad and I have two of these covers that I'll switch out. I also like to keep the wipes right on top. I will link these below, but I just keep them in this little tray and just easy access is nice. And I do use a spray for them that I make. Looks like I need to make some more here soon, but I just keep this on top as well. I wanted to bring some little pink elements in the room. I got both of these from the Target Dollar Spot recently. So I have this cute little pink bird and this little bowl that I keep the spray in. It says, you and me forevermore. Her middle name, I own means purple stone. So I keep this amethyst on the changing table as well as this more aqua turquoise stone. My sister-in-law and brother got me this cute little fox that I keep on the changing table. And I have my lotion from Young Living in the seedling line to put on her legs and feet. They're especially dry, so I keep that on top as well. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check out Stork Crafts Dresser in the description box below, as well as anything else that I mentioned in this video. I hope you enjoyed, and whatever your plans are today, I hope you get them done. Bye, guys. Ooh.